Hey guys, it's Wolf, you're one and only, and today I'm going to be playing Fallen Earth. Now this game is like a post-apocalypse game. It's mixed with a little bit of MMO slash shooter, in a way. And, you know, it actually caught my eye and I kind of wanted to try it out. So let's get started. Now, it does seem to have quite a interesting customization right at the back. Alright, as you guys saw, it doesn't really have a lot of, like, actual in-depth customization, but there was kind of enough for you guys to work with. Now, I spent some time creating my character, let's go ahead and put a name in, and get started. Alright, where are we? Okay. Oh, it seems like I can go first person in this game. And, I can scroll out to third person. So... Uh, tab or middle mouse to aim. Alright, aim system. Alright, so I can actually punch somebody. Hey, bro. Hey. Ooh. <laughs> Knocked his lights out. Oh, I can actually, uh, take his stuff. Uh, I'll take all of his stuff. Uh, this computer you want me at? So this, I'm clicking on it, ma'am. We don't have much time, so I need. You oh, to okay. Me. On the next computer. Oh, okay. You guys, make sure to pay attention over here because it seems like this is the quest place over here, along with some of the other stuff. It seems like teach you how to interact and stuff. Go ahead and put that away. Pretty sure they'll teach us this computer. All right, now we can use it. Good work. That'll keep the cloning cycle going. Now I need you to come get me. I'm on the other side of the Hoover Dam. There's a battle going on, but I'll try to get you through it. Okay. So what about this cloning cycle? This isn't easy to say, so I'm just gonna lay it out. You are a clone. Oh, stormtrooper. Humans created for experimentation and organ harvesting. I'm trying to help you escape. Okay. He's the general for life here in the Hoover Dam. Right now, his forces are under attack by an army of mutants called the Children of the Apocalypse, or Choda. Choda? I'm going to get you out. Choda sounds like a frappuccino drink. My and who are you? I maintain and operate the cloning chamber that produced you. If you want to survive, you need to trust me. Fine, fine. Whatever. Why'd you create me? I could have. I know oh, wow. that sounds awful, but I never had a choice. All I know is, if you don't let me guide you out of there, the Choda are going to find you and remove a lot more than a kidney or two. Okay. I promise, I'll explain once we're safe. All right. Well then, what's your plan, though? my workstation to get access to the dam's security cameras and door controls. I'll guide you from the cloning chamber to where I am using the radio in your clone collar. Now, head down the steps and through the hall. Don't worry. I'll put you on a safe path. Well, the safest, anyway. All right. I'll actually like this game. Citizens, so far. Any unauthorized personnel outside of the living quarters will be shot on sight. Thank you. Okay, thank you for that. Noted. That's Arrow Psy, Master's second in command. Believe me, she means what she says about killing you. Uh, well, you know, I'm pretty sure she did mean that, but I'm gonna try and avoid her. 
I like the game already. It has quite a bit of voice acting for your quests and everything. That's dope. I like games that do that. Do that. What's over here? Well, looks like the Choda have already marked their territory over here, so I'm just going to go this way. You need to find a weapon. Ugh. Well, that axe might work. Oh, this? I'll take it. Now what? Push I to open your pack. Those white right. crew are pinned down right where you need to go. You have to take them out. Got me a better jacket. So do I Ah This looks dope. Hey over here, before the guards spot you. Alright, what up? You gonna tell me something or did you just want me over here? Well, you know, I'm just gonna sneak on over here. They definitely won't see me over here, right? Um, I think they see me. Hey, back off. Why are you guys called White Crow? Uh, I thought that's, thought that said Cow at first. Hey, fight me, die. What are you doing There's back there? Master's men standing guard in the next room. Uh, so... You know, I don't think we need any more of those, but... I think we already got the key, so... You know, no point in scavenging him, too. I think we got two keys. Uh-oh. Yeah, let's just... Destroy that one. I don't know if that turns it into any material or anything, but, you know... We don't need extras. What's in here? Oh, there's another crow over here. Hey, buddy. How are you still shooting me? Die. He got what he deserved. He definitely did. Now, before you leave, try to find a rifle on one of the corpses in here. I wouldn't want you to bring an axe to a gunfight. The weird thing is that you actually have to aim over your opponent or you won't be hitting them at all. Which I actually kind of like because that like puts on a little bit of more survival. Um, so how do I switch to my weapon? Uh, control 2. Control 2. 2. Control. Oh, or I can control scroll wheel. Alright. But control and clicking other things don't seem to work. So, noted. Ah, so I can actually, uh, first person with the rifle, too. Open. Now you're headed for the medical bay. It's where they operate on clones. Be careful. I shall. All units, report to the command center, now! Well, she doesn't seem happy. Oh sweet, I could actually scope in. Uh I guess this guy's a bad guy. That person's a bad guy. That person is too. I'm whiffing shots so hard. Oh, I can reload, okay. Uh can I scope him through here? Take cover! Oh. I don't see any snipers. What the hell are you guys afraid of? I can't take anything from him. Nothing from him. Or anything. Oh, wait, nope. I can't take something from him. Thanks for the ammo, bro. Alright, where are these snipers are talking about? Oh, 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 oh. Hello, guys. Hey. Corner peek. Where's your friend? Um. Bro? <laughs> okay. Well then. Hello there. Good work. But with all the fighting going on, you're going to need some med kits. The light bearers are experts in healing, so I bet they can help you. Alright. Well. Can you help me? 
I would like to learn the word of Many God. thanks for helping us. We came to save these mutants from being slaughtered by Alec Master's scientists, but I didn't think they'd be armed. If you hadn't come, we might not have survived. Who are you? I am Jonas, one of the light bearers. We are many things, warriors, teachers, and healers like myself. We strive to harness the powers of Shiva's touch, what most people call mutations, and use them for good. I would speak further, but I must see to the wounded. Is there anything you need? Um. For years, Alec Masters has kidnapped anyone with Shiva's touch, what most people call mutations. Some of those kidnapped were light bearers, including our leader, Shakti. Masters tortured them in experiments, treated them like animals. He wants the secrets of Shiva's touch for himself. Uh, forgive me, I, I speak too much. I must see to those who survived this fight. All right, if you guys are wondering why I was like moving back and forth, it actually does have like the stereo sound to where you can like hear it from each ear. Like if I was to do like turn this way and he's still talking, it would like come on my right side of the ear. I like that. I like that. This game is actually pretty dope. I like it. Uh, except. Masters will be avenged! The Shota and their allies will pay! Kill them! Kill them! Okay, well. She definitely doesn't seem happy. I gotta definitely avoid her. I mean, jeez. Don't shoot! I need your help! I kind of want to shoot you now. These guys look like enforcers. Oh, I can't shoot you. Them. The hell? Why you guys got dead bodies hanging from the ceiling? Best decoration ever. Oh, traitor. All oh, right, so that's why they're hanging up. Traitor and thief. Well, hmm. Rip those guys. Do you have any med kits? The white crow could be back any second. Who are you? Sergeant Krell, Second Platoon, Charlie Company. We were evacuating some civilians when Master's thugs opened fire on us. We got scattered. Do you have any medical supplies? Uh, what happened to the civilians? They died. We tried to help, but it wasn't enough. Look, the White Crow will be here any minute. Can you help us or not? No. No, I'm just kidding. All right, fine, fine, fine. Uh, what do I do now? All right, click her and... So, push two. What is this? All right, so I'm healing her. Can I heal myself? Hold on. Shit, we've got hostiles incoming. I need your help to fight them off. Ah, oh, so I can't heal myself. All right, go. Reload. Headshot. Guys, I technically am better than you guys. You guys should just hire me. I'll get rid of your Chota. Oh, I can't harp pick up anything from that guy. Does she have anything? Yep. Ammo. Man, they should just replace you guys with me. You guys suck. Jeez. Sniper aim on point. That does not sound promising. Aerosai's got a bomb in the motor pool. I'll run things from here, but you have to disarm that bomb. Otherwise, everyone in the dam is dead. She's trying to blow us up, man. Somebody kill her. Oh, this way? Alright. She's crazy, man. She's trying to just... Hey. 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 What? You didn't hear that? That was loud and everything. Come on, reload. Okay. Now we have to get over here. Oh, hell, they're coming in. Listen, clone. I got this too, but there's more coming. You Okay, so did they get her anything? Um, who yourself and etc. etc. 
Sonic Boom. I just got a lot of things out of nowhere. I don't know where they came from. But... Can I equip these two? Um... Mouse is down here. I'm trying to figure out... Gear. Alright. Wardrobe and... Okay, there we go, there we go. So, I have two pistols to add to my die. Control 5 and Control 6. I don't think those are gonna work. Oh, they actually work now. I can dual wield. Great. That's kind of one of the things I wanted to test. I'm gonna go this way. My, it looks empty on here. What's this? Eight is dash, so I can run. Hey, over here! Never thought I'd be happy to see a clone. Maybe you can help me out. You know what? Turns out there's a bomb in the next room. Quit hating on me. I may be a clone, but you know, I have a feeling. Well, the thing is, the stairs are broken. Once you reach the bomb, there's no way to get back. And there's things down there. What do you mean things? Eh, don't worry about it. Clones are tough. The worst thing that can what? happen is you'll die and come out of a pod somewhere. What 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 do you mean? Hold up. You're gonna you're telling me I have to do a mission and I don't know what the hell you're talking about, like some kind of creatures or something's down there. You want me to do just go in there and just do my mission? On an ATV. If you drive into the vault, I might have a chance. What you know what? Bite me. You see, you're a clone. You'll be fine. I'm not so lucky. The timer's ticking. You know what? I kinda wanna kill you myself right here. You're so lucky the game won't allow me. Yeah. Darn it. Come on, game. Uh. The what a jerk. Right there on the ATV. See those barrels? They're full of toxic waste. Now take a look at the ceiling. See that? Yeah. Why? This room pumps air to most of the dam. If those barrels break open, everyone in the dam is dead. You've got to get the bomb away from the barrels. All right. I'm not a clone. If I jumped down there, I'd break my legs. If I somehow crawled to the ATV and drove into the vault, I'd still be a dead man. But you're different. You'll what? be regenerated, and we can have a few drinks and laugh about it tonight. I'll even buy the drinks. Oh, you're buying? All right, I, I am gamed. Let's do this. Uh, well, you know, I can't even jump over. Well, I literally have to go around. Okay. Man, you're trying to reload a lot for just one bullet. Oh god. Alright, jumping and moving... Like, jumping and moving is, like, really weird. Can I just hold down the... Alright, so apparently if you just hold it down... Alright, this reloading animation is annoying. Good job! Now get on that ATV and drive it into the vault! The reloading animation is a lot longer than it needs to be, especially when your um, when your ammo's already full. But oh, that has nothing on it. That has nothing on it. Well then, you guys actually suck. All right. So I can I just ride this thing first person? Oh God, I can't. Oh, up, up. This is a lot harder than I thought it would be. Alright, this is a lot easier. Alright, I drove it into the vault. Alright, it seems like we have a little cutscene here. Welcome to LifeNet, a product of Global Tech. Okay. If seeing this, you are dead. Oh, well, but shit, thanks. Don't worry, with LifeNet, death is just a minor setback. You may be feeling confused, 
disoriented, or even a little scared. Mostly confused. It's understandable. You just had your vigorous, happy life interrupted by explosion. Please uh, all right. accept our condolences. But no more dwelling on the past. Right now, LifeNet is reconstructing your body. Thanks to our patent, physical fitness will. The magic of rebirth okay. happens inside LifeNet's patented regeneration pods. Okay. Just simple, perfect, finest, refined, and your perfectly cloned body comes out. You've also been fitted with a wireless neural scanner, providing right. dynamic syncing between your brain and the LifeNet database. Noted. Your memories will be. But wait, there's more. Okay. Am I coming in? Clone, can you hear me? It's Elena Winters. Oh, you're the creepy figure in the background. Great. The I was trying to figure out who that was. Dam. It's thanks to you I'm alive to have this conversation. Even so, the battle took its toll. The dam fell to the Choda. The Choda got revenge on Alec Masters, but not before he added one last entry to his list of sins. Masters destroyed the LifeNet core, the mainframe for all the cloning chambers in the province. This has changed everything. So what does that mean? LifeNet's creators never planned for this. They dreamed LifeNet would end the limits of a single lifetime and save humanity from its fear of death. Masters showed us the truth. People are afraid of death. True. But even more afraid of losing control. What? He sacrificed okay. you and every other clone to keep anyone else from having access to immortality. So I did what I could. Oh, so he did. He destroyed the pods. Okay. The auxiliary computers in the province, but it wasn't easy or quick. It's been four years since you died. Jesus. Since the destruction of the core it took you four years to resurrect me. DNA. Worse yet, your future cloning potential has been compromised. You're dying, and I don't know how much time you have. Oh, great. Once you die, you need a sugar coated it or anything. Just you, like it's just like you're dying. There's one way to That's all you this. need to know. You have to find the alpha clones whose DNA makes up the LifeNet database. If you can integrate their undamaged DNA with your own, you can undo what Masters did and restore your immortality. The only clue I found points to the LifeNet facility near Embry Crossroads. There's a LifeNet technician there who can explain the Alpha Clone's location. You're about to wake up in a LifeNet station. The computer there will let you choose where to begin your new life. Remember what I told you. You're special. You were created to be immortal. LifeNet can give you back what Master stole from you. So you're basically saying I'm a god. And don't forget me. I'll never forget you, Bay. I'll always remember you. Anywho, is that the end of the tutorial? Wait, wait, what did that say about vehicles? Oh no! Vehicles. Oh, uh, yep, so they do. They, the vehicles actually consume fuel. So you would have to keep filling it up. What's over here? Can I go back to my rifle, please? Please? Okay. Nope. Alright, there we go. No. That's not my rifle game. Game. Thank you. There's crafting, combat. What about crafting? You have already selected a town. Yes, I did. And what is up with this weird loading screen? All right. I'd rather pick crafting above anything. Crafting is fun. But I'm going to end it here, guys. I might be doing a series on this game because it actually is pretty entertaining so far. And I'll probably drop it if it starts to get boring or anything, or if I stop liking it down the road. But, I hope you guys enjoyed. I did. And this game is actually pretty interesting so far. It's just like an open world shooter and everything like that. And pretty much MMO fused with it. 
so they probably have a lot more to offer so i hope to see you guys on the next video peace out follow me on twitter and facebook and on instagram if you guys want i'll see you guys next time peace out